all MCs, virtual hosts, compeers, I hope this run through of my setup from my place helps you to be specific from my bedroom. <laughs> I hope this helps you. Okay, firstly, strongly recommend 12 by 8 green screen, nothing lesser. Please pick up the stand to put the screen cloth because it will give a very neat finish and it will avoid any kind of folds because even if there is a slightest fold your virtual backdrop will not work don't worry about the storage because once folded they just take in like a stand in a nice bag kind of a space not much the clips must have must have four to six minimum the clip that i'm using is a stationary clip which comes at 15 rupees each of course you can go ahead with a 70 rupees or a 80 rupees one serves the same purpose but it looks very professional because it's black please only use a c do not use a fan because that will add to the outside noise. The sitting of course looks comfortable and has to be comfortable but most importantly I have placed it in such a way that I can straight away look into the camera. I love the web camera because the circle is so round and big that I, I, can, I know where I'm looking in. Also this is the best brand. I definitely suggest this. My screen is really, really big. My monitor screen is big because I love feeling the energy of my audience. Aren't we all missing the live events? So it's very important uh, at live events, we enjoy the energy of our audience. What you give is what you get back. So it's very important that I feel the energy. I give them good energy. So the monitor big, yes. I have my hacks of keeping my cue cards. These are examination pads. You get them at the stationery shop. You can use anything. I've pasted one as well. So you can have your own hacks because I'm an MC who loves just talking naturally. But I keep my pointers around. And this really helps. Most important, your ring light should have yellow and white because only white supports the virtual green setup. And also don't wear any green outfit. This should, of course, be adjustable. I love using this during the day. This is a reflector. I definitely suggest sunlight during the day. It's so amazing, the natural light. Sunlight hits there, then it hits my face. So you just angle it that way. It's 700 rupees. It's called a reflector. I love it for another reason as well, because when you turn it around, it is black. And sometimes if you just want a plain black virtual backdrop that will serve the purpose please 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 get a tripod stand it has multi-purpose usage i don't even have to explain because it's really important as a woman uh, or a, you know it's important to keep my mirror my touch up my lipsticks and of course uh, just you know give that touch up I ensure I keep my remotes of ac around so that sometimes if I feel hot cold I am in control of it and doesn't distract and I'm really synced in. Please keep water bottle. Please keep it at the closest proximity where you can, you know, mute yourself and just have a quick sip when there is a, of water when there is a performance or something that doesn't require you. I have my little mug right here just to keep myself motivated. Please keep things that make you happy. Very important. Also have these short little refreshments, not much to eat or uh, anything that will you know make noise or you know just as you're munching it and you know you suddenly can't talk so keep something which is very very light and quick refreshments most importantly a lot of people forget how important a timer is as an mc sometimes you also play the role of a moderator so timer is very important this is just a normal me smartwatch that i have and i'm using it as a timer right here 2000 or 2500 rupees and any sort of a timer i mean you can go for anything but please keep it a lot of people don't do these small things. Please do these small things. Now, this is a lens cleaner. Now, you get them with your sunglasses or you get them with your spectacles. Very important to clean the lens, be it your camera, be it your tab, be it your laptop or your monitor. So, please, please, please. Small little things make a lot of difference. I hope you can, uh, you know, just add on this if you have not added it so far. Please go for wireless mouse and a wireless keyboard. Yes, because you don't want to be stuck with the wires and all the you know difficulties this you can move at a space that you want to sometimes you know you're, you're just being showed uh, until your stomach and sometimes completely full so it really depends but as long as you have this wireless you're really good to go please keep stationery pens markers whatever you need because it's very important i have invested in a great graphic card because uh, my usb is interaction so i use music i use ppt so graphic card merged 
this is something that I want to tell you. Please, please have your headphones which are wireless, your plugs, okay? Now, these are Galaxy Buds. I really love them. One, because they also pick up my voice. Two, when I'm wearing them, there is no other outside noise that can disturb me. Three, they are wireless, so it doesn't look shabby. And once charged, I can use them like for an entire day. So this is something that I love. But of course, if you have something that's wireless, please go for something that's wireless and professional. A good, of course, a good brand or a good quality. Now, I sound so great because of this. So please, please, please ensure you invest on a mic. Very important. And now this mic comes at a two pin or three pin or whatever. So you get a cord for it. Please buy that cord so you can use it on your monitor. You can use it on your tab, on your phone, on your laptop. So please buy the cord and most importantly, please buy the extension wire. Again, I'm saying you don't know at what distance you're going to be standing or seated. So please have them. Try and avoid wires as much as possible, but this is required. That's exactly why I'm saying this is a must have. Most importantly, in this entire setup, I hope I've covered uh, most of the points. But most importantly, in the setup, when you have a green screen, please don't have any light behind it. Just have a wall. And uh, what I have is my restroom right behind. So can you see just little this little space and I can quickly run use my restroom, come back. So just these small little things will ensure that you're focusing on your work and you can deliver the most to your clients. And most importantly, please check for a good Wi-Fi. Your Wi-Fi might be great in terms of optic fiber and quality, but it can't be unstable. For which 50 MBBS above is recommended upload download speed. Otherwise, please, please tell your event managers, please tell your clients you do not want to experiment at their cost. They have trusted you, so please just be upfront to them and say, hey, I don't think uh, today my speed's looking great. But of course, you can't do that on the day of the event, so please check it before and keep backups. Uh, there are a lot of options in that again as well. You can have two connections, you can have routers. There's some routers which um, will help you pick up immediately in a few seconds if there is a power fluctuation or one drop. So again, Wi-Fi, very, very important. So I hope I covered it all. Of course, um, I don't know if you're like me, if you love uh, sound bars so that you feel like you're in a live event. Of course, we are missing the energy. But with this kind of music, uh, I just feel like, wow, I'm just in sync. I ensure no noise from outside. I tell my family, I tell everyone. So it's you can always hear the clock ticking. Yeah, that's the kind of silence you must and should have. And I hope this helps you all.